This field game has been inspired by ancient religious texts and has been designed up and goes by too fast for me to read. Here's the intro. Uh oh. Let me tell you a tale. It took place 360,000. No, 14,000 years ago. If you say so. Well, to me it seems like only yesterday. To you, could be tomorrow. It's the story of a man, known by 72 different names. <laughs> what should I call him? When we first met, his name was Enoch. Hyatt, come on. And even then, he wouldn't let anyone tell him what to do. Not even me. But he was a pretty good guy. Should die, Essentia of the Metatron. Press start. Green save data. Well, since we're here, hello everybody, this is Kyra Punch Steven. We're playing El Shaddai, Essentia of the Metatron, and Million Trophies. This game is. I liked it. It's, it's a beautiful game. I played it through it before, but no one knows about this game. Um, before I start playing, just know that this is a game of religious backgrounds. So I'm not trying to offend anybody. It's just a good educational experience through this interpretation of those ancient scripts. It's actually pretty fun. Save complete, thank you. The armor okay? If not, I could... No problem. Everything's fine. Yeah, it looks awesome. Where are we? Cowabunga! Whoa, there's no ground. And we're falling. Cog War style. Ooh, I'm sick in that. Iron Man. I warned you not to follow us. Watch your as you tell. And of course, I. Um, oh my god, it's. Nice. Close. He's doing bad. Oh my god. I have like no weapons and I'm dead. Already. On your feet, Enoch. You get more than one chance, you know. It's your coin now. Uh. Okay. You presume you're actually anytime in the library! What library? Um. Oh, I'm supposed to press something. Oh. Probably back in time. I'm just that awesome. We're. Gone too far. We're back to the start screen. It's time, Enoch. Are you ready to leave? No, I'm ready. I gotta say, I'm kind of looking forward to this trip. Say, you've not been down below for some time, have you? Looks like the not. You're in for a surprise. Why? Enoch, you sure that's enough armor? What? What? I'll take the best you have. Right. Time to go. Power up! Enoch. Yes? The journey begins, chapter 00. Okay. See those figures in the distance? Mm-hmm. What about them? Try and reach them. Can I move? No, not yet. There, now I can. Can I jump? I can jump! Oh. 
What? Hey, come back here. You're cheating. They're still out there. Okay, yeah, I can still jump. Whoa. The tools and weapons humans use are all based on wisdom from heaven. Oh. Okay. Wis like the books. Wisdom humans couldn't attain in a thousand years. Uh, we could try. Running faster, which we need. Come on. On with anyway, try jumping to those figures. Big jump. The fruits of wisdom were created by God. They can be they can be helpful to people or they could be abused for evil. It all depends on how you use them. Don't let the enemies draw near them draw near them in battle. What? Okay. Can you take it from here? Uh sure. Enoch. <laughs> Humans have a unique gift. The power of choice. Free will. They can follow any path they desire. Get out of my face. So choose your path carefully. The future of mankind depends on it. Can you get like new abilities? Come on. Not bad. I did pretty good, I say. If you're that good with your bare hands, let's see how you handle one of God's weapons. Say a babalus or whatever the Klingon thing is. It's one of those little shards of wisdom the fallen angel stole. There we go. Now try it, Enoch. Mm -hmm. Let's go! Come on! Let's kill some of these things. Ah, oh, much better. See you. Whoa. Whoa, what? What I do? It was only when various shards of God's wisdom were stolen that Semyaza's betrayal was uncovered. But by then, he, together with the Grigori he led, had already fled. Uh, angels have ran away. I don't know these ones. Trophy! The journey begins. Nicely done, Enoch. Okay. We're back here. Ah, the Archangels are here. Ooh, where? Let's see. Uh, one, three. All is as Lucifer has shown. Lucifer. We, the Archangels, shall guide you with our voices. Okay, speak. Enoch, you must return the fallen angels to heaven. That is your mission. Okay, no problem. Don't worry. We'll be with you, all the way. We'll be with you, always. Careful now, we're crossing over. To the other side. How many fingers does that have? Once we breach the veil, we'll be on Earth. Bring back any memories, Enoch? The controller is shaking like crazy. Seven angels have fallen to Earth. Big mistake. We're going to tear out their souls and lock them in this prison for eternity. At World's End, Chapter 1. Okay, seven angels have fallen. So, I just... Let's start with this one. I hit it once. Ezekiel. She talks of love, but doesn't know the meaning. 
if you guys are watching Supernatural right now, some of these names might sound familiar. But Ezekiel was a name that was mentioned. I only hit it once. Why do I hit it more times? Good luck getting him to repent. Armor Ross. Armor Ross. Armor Ross. And. Sariel, don't let his idea of love fool you. But what if I love him? There we go. Arachiel, we can't let him live out his days on Earth. Rakiel? Rakiel? Rakiel. Uh, he has a face on this side and the other side. Or if that's a hint at something. Last one, I think. Barakel. May this be the place he dies. Barakel. 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 And. Is there one more? Oh, there is! I must have missed one. Semyaza. You know the boss. Used to be an elder on the council. Oh. Four eyes. Must be special. Okay, so I must have missed one on this side of this. Stop. Azazel, leader of the Grigori, and Semyaza's right hand man. Is that. That was the name we saw like a moment ago, wasn't it? I'm back in the mill. Watch out, Enoch. Oh. Oh, new crap. Noctu. You can dance if you want to. Haha. <laughs> what? Flame of power raises Enoch's level. Yeah, raises Enoch's latent, latent abilities. Okay. Oh, there's more. If you guys haven't noticed this, let's play a little bit like God of War and a lot of other games. I'll do play like God of War. But again, I'm playing this game mostly because it is so underrated. It is a really beautiful game to look at. You'll see. I love eye candy. And a lot to learn from. Like, I, I'm not religious or anything, but I don't think... This is like the background of the Christian faith, and this is something that mm, this is not even talked about in the Bible at all. Before Adam and Eve... I think, well, I'm not going to debate when this was. Ooh, come on! Come on, you! There's so many of them. They keep coming. There's different abilities as we go on. Uh, I didn't expect to do that, but okay. And I launched them right there. You done yet? There's more. There's always more. Uh, we hit. We hit the ground. Your journey begins here. Uh, what? Yeah. 